Matt Fincher and the Upstate Spartans come away a walk-off winner in the series opener against the Jacksonville Dolphins. And, Coach, this just one where your team hung around long enough, finally ground out a victory. They did. Uh, they did some good things early, and then, uh, you know, their pitcher settled in and really pitched a great game. And we were struggling there, and then finally, you know, we're able to break through at the end. So, you know, certainly it's, it's a nice win for us. Our last glimpse of Tyler Jackson this year, a pretty good pitcher. End up retiring the last seven batters he faced, had a seven strikeout performance. Talk about what he meant to your team as your Friday night starter this year. Well, I mean, he, he, you know, he earned his way in the whole way through the season. And, uh, you, know, you know, he's been a really good pitcher for us all year long, been pretty consistent. And I was really pleased with the way, uh, you know, he handled tonight. And he seemed, uh, you know, he had a little bump there. Uh, and, and, you know, I guess that's the fifth. And then, but then after that, you know, he was, he was good. And at one point I was thinking about taking him out. And I'm like, well, he's, he, he seems to be starting to strike everyone out again. So I left him in there. So I was, I'm, I'm real happy for him, you know, his final start to pitch like that. That's nice. Hathaway's turned into a pretty nice option for you out of the pen. He sure has. Surprised me. You know, he came in midway through the year and, and wanted to know about when he was going to pitch. And, and we finally, you know, got him out there. And, boy, is he thrown well. So, uh, you know, rest his arm and get him out there again as quick as we can. Coach, you go toe-to-toe -to -toe tonight with a team that's battling for the Atlantic Sun crown right into the final week here. What does it say about the development of your team this season? Well, I mean, we're, we're capable. Um, you know, I don't know, uh, you know, day in, day out if the guys uh, fully and completely understand that. But, you know, we play, you know, a lot of close games this year. We really have. And, uh, you know, tonight I think is an indication that, um, you know, we can do it. Uh, we are capable. And uh, you hope that they learn from the experience and, and mature and, and, and get better as we go. How fitting is it that a freshman, one of your young players, Devin Ortiz, with a, a team that's looking with a mind toward the future, is able to get the walk-off hit? Yeah, well, I mean, I, I like that for him. You know, we've had some issues with striking out in situations. And tonight, uh, you know, certainly we did a better job of just contacting the ball and getting it in play. You know, you go back uh, – folks uh, sack fly early and, and Ortiz did a great job of staying on the base instead of jumping off when that guy dove for it and then uh, you know Beaver uh, Beaver had, had an at bat where he just put the ball in play and good things happened and then right there uh, you know Ortiz gets two strikes on him pretty quick and then and then you know but he's able to put the ball in play and 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 good things happened two games still left in the series but what's your takeaway from the opener well, I mean, uh, you know, good game. I mean, you know, they they showed me uh, good pitching, which is what I thought they were going to show me. And, uh, you know, certainly they're, they're going to hit at some point. So, uh, you know, we want to keep their offense under control and, and see if we can get into another game just like that with them and, and, and see if we can uh, steal another one. Well, thanks, and Coach, and congratulations. All right, thank you. The weather on this Thursday night of the final series opener of the year, anything but what you'd want. However, the result is exactly that. 4-3, upstate a walk-off winner over the Dolphins of Jacksonville.